Oh, right now we are taking a live look out in Pecola. Zach, what do people need to know when heading out this morning? Uh, it's a little cloudy out there, but we're dry. It's going to be a cool day. I guess the big news is, and I should have led with this, don't bury the lead, right? Uh, it's not as cold as it was yesterday, Tiffany, and that's that's uh, good news for many folks out there. Not everyone's a cold weather fan. Uh, we were starting out right uh, mid-20s in spots. So Fayetteville this time yesterday was 24, 25, 42 little more comfortable outside. Still cool. We're looking at jacket weather across the River Valley. Mid 40s, 45, 46 degrees across most of the area. 52, even a little better for us down in Poto. 51, Hevener. Uh, 46, good morning to you, Greenwood. Uh, good morning to you uh, across the River Valley from Johnson, Franklin, Crawford, Sebastian counties, Scott, Logan, LaFleur counties. Hope everyone is enjoying a little milder start today compared to the lower 40s we're seeing in parts of northwest Arkansas. Today's still going to be a cool day, though temperatures across the region are going to probably be a degree or two at least warmer than yesterday. Now, sometimes a degree or two when you talk about sensible weather isn't really enough for us to feel a difference. River Valley could be warm enough that you do notice a little more distance or difference. I'll show you that in a second. We're looking at 50s today, mid to upper 50s across northwest Arkansas. Cloudy skies. We could still have some gusts around 20 miles per hour today. A little breezy, a little cloudy. I think that still makes for a cool day for us where you'll want to keep the jacket around. Now, River Valley, we'll have a chance to see low 60s in the River Valley. And the further south you go from the I-40 corridor, a little bit better chance to see a mix of low to mid 60s. That's not too bad, right? This is all added ahead of our next front that comes in, drags in colder air for Thanksgiving Day, for Black Friday, a reinforcing shot of cooler air coming in Saturday into Sunday. But also it's going to bring a chance of a little patchy drizzle and mist. We saw some of this with the front that came in on Monday. I think we could see that again too. Not all the ingredients come together to give us a real rain chance, uh, or certainly anything to measure, but uh, enough that we could uh, dampen things up. Northwest Arkansas first, late afternoon, 3, 4, 5, 6 o'clock, our patchy drizzle sprinkle chances, they're going to start picking up for us. You can see that here, the model doing a good job picking up on it. Doesn't show a whole lot uh, because it's really struggles with showing rainfall and drizzle and mist. But I think the atmosphere and the conditions we have, I think we're going to have a little more drizzle popping around than what the model was showing there. And then we may have a little light band set up overnight of some sprinkles and drizzle uh, near and south of the I-40 corridor. Again, behind the front, everyone gets the cooler air, 20s and 30s. We may even have some wind chills tomorrow morning in the lower to mid-20s in northwest Arkansas. And then a chilly Thanksgiving day, 40s to the north, 40s and low 50s across the southern half of five country with a north breeze about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Many of you are going to be heading up to Columbia, Missouri, Missouri to watch the hogs and the tigers. If you are, uh, snow chances have been increasing with that one. It's going to be a cold one. You're going to want to bundle up there. Uh, game time temperatures uh, around kickoff around 31. That game may end in the upper 20s, ladies. And the wind chill, always talking about that wind chill to make it feel even a little bit colder there. Again, a lot of chilly weather here as we wrap up November and head into December. I believe December 1st is Sunday. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, yeah, can you believe that? And uh, we're looking for 40s, 50s, some cold mornings in there. 20s even in the River Valley. We may have a couple mornings where some teens mix in north.